Good morning, she bizzle. Let's go, baby. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I am so proud of JB. She didn't go pee pee in bed. I know she knows it's time for chocolate. We pulled the sofa to the side because we're because we're hosting a Thanksgiving dinner. We're having lunch at my parents' house, and then for Benji's family, we're having it here. There's a whole lot of people coming, so we're kind of rearranging the furniture. And look at the rug. It's weird that the covered rug is brown, and then the exposed one is white. But I thought it would be the opposite. Because it's been vacuumed? Oh, you're right. Sure enough, it's all those little fibers. <laughs> I just sat down to vlog this. You're such a character. We've had this rug for over two years Mommy, now. And in the beginning, I would always complain because every time I sat down or anybody, mm, any of our guests black. came in there wearing black, they would be covered with all the fibers from the rug. I remember when I asked the lady that I bought it from, I was like, why is that, can I return it? And she said, it's very common with 100% wool rugs. So she said, just over time, it will get better. And it didn't get better till like recently. So it takes two years for your rug to kind of settle. The color difference. Yeah, your books. We found two books under the sofas. Which books did you find? Show me. This one. What's that? Honey, can um, move these amusement out of park. Here? Can I move them out? Let them haul around. Yeah. This one was throwing up or something. What do you mean throwing up? <laughs> can you take off Mia's bib, JB? Please. You know how, oh, wow. Like this. Uh, there you go. Can you take it off? Thank you. <laughs> now, what exactly are you trying to do, K-Bear? Where are you going? Whoop! <laughs> Which one? Black. <gasps> Red, yes. Good job. What color is that? Yellow. Good job. Hey, Elsa just wants to meet the older Elsa. Hi, Elsa. <laughs> hey, Bear. Hey, Bear. Hey, Bear. I'm trying to take an Instagram photo of the two Elsas and JB's not having it. I think Mia's over My arms are getting tired. I know, it's nap time, huh? Nap they just time. wanted to be helped by daddy. Mm -hmm. Poor K-Bear. I don't think she's feeling well because all day today she's kind of been spitting up her food. Um, she spit up a little bit of her milk and then while she was eating her breakfast, she spit up even more milk. And then right as I'm about to give her some milk for nap time, she spat up again. I just let her lay on my chest and then I rocked her to sleep. Now it's Mia's turn. Ooh. Animals, animals. Animals, which animal is that? Roar. A roar? That's a tiger. Julian, Where's give mommy a massage. massage. Uh -huh. There you go. She's... Okay. <laughs> it's a new uh, magnetic massage. A magnetic Wait. massage. There you, you go. Cool. My hair too? Maybe she oh. saw that. Maybe she saw in a commercial or something. She's so sweet. She was giving me kisses on the cheek from the couch. I love that these girls are holding the bottom themselves. Oh, she just nice. gave you a kiss. She's exhausted. Nice. Go ahead, kiss mommy. I am just so proud of JB. Mommy and JB just went potty together. <laughs> As a reward, of course, she gets two pieces of chocolate and we've been doing like the little M&Ms. Now we're gonna clean up our mess and we're gonna watch a movie. But you gotta help Mommy, come on. Clean up. I know, I know, a moose, a moose, a moose. 
It's like a little slumber party in the living room. I have our pillows here, grabbed a nice cozy blanket, and then JB and I are just gonna choose a movie or, I don't know, a show on Hulu or Netflix. Daddy, you're missing out on our movie day. While the girls are sleeping, JB and I are gonna lounge. No, that's a pillow, you silly butt. She needs more slack. You're taking up all that blanket, honey. Whatever. Oh, what's the pen? You must select. Oh, I don't understand. Okay. Somehow we have technical difficulties. I can't sign on to Hulu or Netflix. What the dealio? I don't even know what's on cable. Never watch cable anymore. I guess we have to change our password. <laughs> I feel like we have 50 different passwords for different things and then you forget it and then... <laughs> I feel like a mother tiger to her baby tiger or her cub. I love you so much. Baby, baby. You, oh, you're a baby. Oh my gosh, half an hour later, we figured it out and we're watching Cat in the Hat Christmas Edition. I don't think JB has any Dr. Seuss books. I'm gonna get ready for my day, and even though I'm probably not even gonna go, ooh, the clouds are so beautiful. Anyway, sorry. I started looking up recipes for turkey because I'm gonna bake my first turkey today. I have no experience whatsoever, so I YouTubed it, and I found like a, your first roasted turkey for the holidays, and it's like a five minute video or something, so. I'm going to attempt that and hopefully I don't fail because that's going to be the only turkey at my parents' house. But anyway, I'm just going to get ready for my day even though I probably am not going to go out. I just always feel kind of blah whenever I don't have makeup on. Whenever I see myself with makeup, I feel more lively. So hopefully a little bit of eyeliner and maybe a lipstick will help brighten my day. Baby's watching her little egg surprise videos. So I know I said I wouldn't dress them in matchy matchy outfits all the time, but when I do, it's so friggin' cute! <laughs> and they're about to grow out of these onesies, the little sister ones. I just need to find a headband downstairs. We have a billion and one headbands, bows, ribbons. I don't put it on them often because they pull it off of each other's head and then I get afraid whenever it wraps around their neck. So on my Instagram, I noticed a lot of people were asking what I had on my lips the other day when I had that MAC makeover. And shoot, don't tell me I did, oh yeah, I did buy the lip liner. It is Be Spoken For Lip Liner. I got this one because it glides on so smooth and it's super pigmented. It's really dark. I don't have an uber dark liner, so I thought I would just try it out. And the lipstick, he put two different lipsticks on in me. And I know one of them was a Rihanna Red. Viva Glam, and then the darker one, I, I forget what it was. I didn't end up getting that color. Today, I'm wearing MAC lip liner in Auburn, and on the inside, I'm wearing Revlon Color Burst Matte Balm in Standout number 250. Uh-oh, no, 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 don't chew on that one, baby. So I'm testing out my recipes today. Actually, just a mashed potato. I know mashed potato is easy, but this time I'm using the Blendtec because uh, when I did it with the yams, it was super creamy. And then, yeah, JB's drawing. I'm thawing our little turkey. It's just a mini one because this is just going to be uh, mom and dad's house. I think there might be four families there, but there's going to be lots of food, I'm sure. Ooh, somebody's really enjoying their green beans. I'm finally going to try the Oprah chai tea that I got at, what was it, Starbucks. I'm pretty sure when I had it at Starbucks there was sugar and stuff. I don't think this one has sugar. It's like the loose leaf kind, so I need to do it old school. Perfect, I found the little tea thingy with jigger. Oh, and Kira's kissing the fridge. Hi there! Look how much was in this container. What is that? It's Oprah chai tea. Huh. But look how little it is. That's like any bag of potato chips. Yeah. <laughs> Did you want to try some of this? Yeah. <laughs> Looks like she's trying to touch the tea. That's it's funny. And then you just dip it in. 
What are you guys doing? <laughs> you love your sister's feet, don't you? Poor Keeper, she's so out of it today. And it's only 3.10. Their nap is usually around 3.45. Can you hang in there 30 more minutes, baby? Um, Hi, are you still awake? Yeah. So my mashed potato is a complete fail. I feel like an idiot because mashed potatoes, you know, it's simple. I thought we'd try it on the blend tech, but it turned it into like a dough. And then to make it less thick, I added more milk and put it back on the stove. And then now it's just a potato soup. So I want to add in some bacon in there. Ooh, soup. Lamb and butternut squash soup. So this week on Blue Apron, I got a whole bunch of Thanksgiving themed dishes. And I'm about to cook this soup up. Ground lamb, which I've never used before. Onions, garlic, uh, some kind of barley, what to say? Pearl barley, thyme, bay leaves, normal stuff, spinach, parmesan. Very simple dish. I love one pot meals because it's easy. Two bundles of it, so I'm gonna make enough for a little appetizer soup for tomorrow's Thanksgiving so that everybody can have a little, you know, a little something to nibble on before we get started. Do you want me to help you make them? Yes. Sure. They yeah. are so easy to make mashed potatoes. Yeah. Please. Oh, please do. Do you have potatoes? Oh, we have a billion potatoes. You know what? Okay. I mean, if you want to make it for tomorrow, did you want to make it here or at your place? Oh, it doesn't matter. Val, if you want a uh, soupy mashed potato, then <laughs> don't, don't help us. No, there's such thing as potato soup, okay? Oh, so okay, that's, that's good. Did you, did you eat this? I tried it. Here, let's try it. Take a spoon. She's watching Auntie Val make the potatoes. It's so hot. Do you want to Hot. It's hot. <laughs> right. Green juice. It's been a few days. I forgot how to drink from a straw. There you go. Wait, close. Close your mouth. Close your mouth. Come on, you were doing it. Oh. Okay, come on, try again. Sorry, there you go, there you go. There you go. Oh, yeah. Do you know what's in eggnog? I have no idea. Is that yummy? <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> so, you know how I was doing the mashed potatoes and I'm like, this is so weird. It was like sticky and doughy. It turned out I put eggnog in the potatoes. It doesn't say eggnog at all on this carton. I just read local grass-fed grade I thought, A I thought pasteurized. Valerie was like addicted to the eggnog. Well, that's what I was, I was like, just saying. Dang. Like, no, you tried all of that. I haven't tried it because it looked more empty. So, <laughs> so I, I turned around and I was like, what are they talking right, well, about? Now that I know that I didn't drink all of that. Oh. So half the eggnog in her mashed potatoes, thinking. No wonder. Milk. I was like, this just doesn't make sense. Why is it this <laughs> sticky? Wow. Nami. Oh, we're so appreciative. Thank you, Auntie Val. Non doughy mashed potato. And it tastes really good. It's like. <laughs> That's just such a weird thing. Creamy. You're probably the only person in history that ever made that mistake. You should be proud of that. Oh, hex! If you saw this in your fridge, would you think, oh, it's eggnog? No, nowhere on here does it say eggnog except for the cap. Which is like really tiny. Yeah, you know the writing thing about so. it. It wasn't very yellowy. Yeah. It wasn't. It looked it white looked as like milk. It is it regular eggnog the yellow? The first time I went in to to get the eggnog, I looked at it. and I was like, mm, I think this is a milk jug. It must be JB's like organic milk. Mm -hmm. So I was looking at it, and so I didn't get it at first. And then like a couple hours later, I went back. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad. See, it's not bad. Anyway, so Benji finished his squash soup with lamb and I tried a little bite and I personally do not like lamb. And I was thinking maybe it's a nice subtle flavor. It straight up tastes like lamb soup. So JB tried it for the first time and she absolutely refused it. Oh man, what's it blurry the whole time? No, it really, it's missing something. The lamb soup is missing something. No, it just straight up tastes like lamb and JB just doesn't like the flavor. I don't know, maybe it's just no, a acquired taste. I can, I can make it taste better. Mm, try that. 
try that. She wants to try what's over there. That's Auntie Val's mashed potatoes. That's for tomorrow, baby. Here, what is that for? This is a knife and fork set. I get all wounds outside with the dishes. Hi, Dad. Say hi to the vlog. Obachan? <laughs> it was the first thing she said when she saw Grampy. Obachan? Obachan? Bye-bye, Obachan. Mom sits on the stool. You know that. She doesn't like spots. Cannot not like spots. Here. Dishes. Oh, did you find two dogs? Wow. And brown. What's, brown? Hey, That'd be mommy. really nice. Oh, yeah. hi there, brown. Brown and His Buster. name is brown. I'm here at my parents today to help my mom actually set up some of the Christmas decor. And uh, mom hasn't set up her tree yet, but since we have family coming over tomorrow, mommy. that'd be perfect. Mommy. When I was growing up, I never had a real tree. So it wasn't until I think last Christmas I had a real tree. And I didn't like it because maybe it was just a tree that we picked, but it was so prickly. And every time I put a present under the tree or right underneath the base of the tree, the pine needles poked me really bad and then I started getting rashes. Wow. Wow. Yeah, this is a Christmas tree, baby. This will be exciting. Oh snap, are there lights on it already? There are lights, how cool. The tree is assembled. I just need to pull out all these branches. Babies are calm. <laughs> how are you guys doing in that little pack and play? You having fun? Yeah? And Charlie Brown Christmas is on. We're back home. I actually wasn't able to finish the tree because Mia and Kira were kind of going berserk. And then JB was on the toilet and then it was just like getting so hectic. And I didn't want to bother mom because she just got back from dialysis. So I just took the kids and left while she was taking a nap. But uh, anyways, JB and I are building a choo-choo. Choo-choo train. We're building train tracks. The girls are happy mommy, now that they're mommy, getting their milk. Mommy. Your butt! Chugga 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 choo choo! That's fun? Oh good, I'm glad it's fun. I'm gonna eat this! I'm nom 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 <laughs> Squishy Wonderland SG. When you guys juice your green juices, do you blend the veggies raw? And for the fruits, do you blend it with the seeds and skin? So yes, we do blend the veggies raw. That's the best way to consume most vegetables. And second question is yes to the skin, sometimes no to the seeds of fruit. But we almost always leave the skin on most fruits because that's where the nutrients are. Uh, it's beautiful. Look at me. You look at me. Look at mom. No need to cry over that, okay? Photo, photo. She wants to, take to a watch selfie? Play Doh. No. She calls Play Doh photo. <laughs> okay, guys, we're gonna call it a night. Baby. Mommy. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Happy Thanksgiving. Well, tomorrow. Maybe most of you guys are already watching this on Thanksgiving. So hopefully you have a great Thanksgiving and we'll catch you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Give flying kiss. <laughs> okay. Really, I mean it. I'm eating it out. She doesn't no, believe you, you anymore. Yeah, I get it all. Um, nom, 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 nom.